Today I'll be showing you how to download the old versions of Siege through the Throwback Discord. All I ask is that you like and subscribe. Once you open this tab, it will say it's a virus. You have to go to settings, privacy, security, and turn it off. Once you have it off, it will download, or you can just uh, refresh the tab and it will download. I'm gonna open up the file once you download it. Just install it. I already have it downloaded, so I have to do it again. I'm gonna open up the, the throwback server. Go to game downloads, and you scroll up. And from what I know how to do it, I downloaded this one. This one worked fine for me. And then once you install it, before you install it actually, you will have to go to Windows and deactivate uh, your virus, antivirus. So you just click on this, and then you turn on settings, and then you turn off real time protection. You will need WinMark to extract the file, and you want to go here where it says extract file. And you want to find a folder that has space so you can create one and then press OK once uh, you find the folder. So you want to open the, the installer, which is this one, go to continue, game downloader, and bring this to the middle. And you choose what which one you want, I want dust on. And then once you click on it, you do have to own it on Steam. So you want to use your legacy name, um, which is like your very first original um, Steam name. And then you want to connect it, and it will ask for your password and um, for Steam Guard to activate. Then it will start downloading. Once this starts, um, sometimes you will get errors, but just let it go through and it'll finish. Once it's done, it'll ask you to press a key, and that's all you have to do, and it's done. So, once you have it downloaded, you go to downloads, you find which, um, everyone you downloaded. You scroll down until you find Rainbow Six, the one with the biggest, um, size. For different, um, seasons, it's different names, so just go with the bigger, um, sized one. So, just open up Rainbow Six. So, once you first started, it will say something about um account not being synced. Just press OK, and that's how you first started up. Now I'm gonna show you how to get skins and actually play. If you actually want to play like Terra and custom games, you will need to scroll up and download R6 Liberator. Just download anyway, it is safe. Just keep error of it installed. So once Liberator installed, you want to open it. And then it'll pop up here. So then you can start up your game. So this works for any operation, any season that you're playing to start up a terrorist hunt or like any other situations or custom game with other people. You start up a custom game, local, you create one, already have one set up, create as player, then you wanna go to R6 Liberator. And for Terrasan, you just click what difficulty you want, pops up the map, whether you want it hostage, you know, different modes, day and night. So for this we wanna do elimination, Make sure you double click it, bottom right it will change. Once that is there, all you have to do is click S to start it, and you'll be in. And to join someone, um, for the 10 men that I'm in, we use Radman VPN to download it. Open it, click yes. I already have it installed, so you set it up. So you can create one. You can have a network name and you, put, you set the password. And then of course, if you wanna join someone, once they set up the, the server and this, you just put join existing, you uh, put the network name and the password. Then 
You just open up R6, go to local, join, and eventually the name will pop up. And you just refresh until the name um, appears, and then you'll be able to join. So if you want to change your name, you go to Codex. And where it says game name, you put the, the season or operation that you're in. So since I'm in white noise, if you type in white noise with no space, account ID, you literally just, this is going to be COD3. It's going to keep on saying it. So just literally just put random um, letters, numbers, whatever, for the account ID. That just has to be different. Then your username, you can change to whatever you want. And it'll save. Now make sure to either press Control S or click up here and then save. Once that is done, you can exit out. I hope this video helped you out. If you have any problems, I would recommend contacting the R6 Discord and getting help there. This is what I did. This would work for me. I didn't have any problems on my end. And if you have any questions, I might be able to help. So leave them down below.